And when we talk about strength, Mountain Girl, I know you've been right mm -hmm. there from the very beginning. No, actually, I got I didn't get on the board till 1987, and that's um, close enough to the beginning. That is pretty close. But but I just like to say that um, back in those days, the whole Grateful Dead organization, all the employees had the had a right to submit a, a grant proposal, uh, be it uh, written on a napkin or whatever, just verbally. Uh, when we were going to have a meeting, and uh, that was the way we could, uh, as a as a group, uh, you know, really look after people's requests that were part of our organization at the time. And that was that was during a time when we really had a lot of money, and we really had a lot of people working for the Greater Grateful Dead organization. So it was really um, a, a lot of folks in those meetings, I'll tell you. And uh, we had a number of different presidents. Let's see, we had Ramrod was president for a while, and I think you were president for a while. Oh, well, maybe not. And uh, you know, we sort of passed it around, and uh, the meetings were pretty noisy and fun and carefree. Let's let's give them five thousand dollars. Somebody would shout from the back of the room, and yeah, he'll and, know from here. And, and somebody said, "No, give them six. <laughs> and it went, and it kind of would go like that. And they were raucous events. Yeah, and because they had done these series of shows, often three shows in a row, there was there was plenty of cash to give away, and uh, that was that was really a lot of fun, and and we were able to do things that no other foundation would even dream of doing, which was giving away money with no strings and no expectation of of uh, either product or report in the end. So it was really. It was really an exercise in kindness for everybody involved in the Grateful Dead organization. It made a huge difference in how we felt about it.